This is a video on how to make the striped corkscrew. The striped corkscrew is a combination of the striped wall and the corkscrew. The striped corkscrew starts the same way as a striped wall and after you do the starting stitch all of the other stitches are done the same way as the corkscrew stitch, which is the diagonal wall. But starting it like a striped wall is what gives it the unique look. Let's get started. You will need four pieces of gimp, three that are all the same length, and one that is one and a half times the length of one of the shorter pieces. My shorter pieces are each four feet long and my longer piece is six feet long which should be plenty of gimp to make the lanyard. Start by taking one of your shorter pieces and bend it at its center and drop it all the way to the right side of your index finger. Take the strand hanging at the back and wrap it around to make a second loop on the other side of your finger. Take another one of your short pieces and bend it at its center. Drop it in the middle of your finger between the two loops that you already made. Take the strand hanging at the front and wrap it around to make another loop all the way on the left. Take your third short piece and bend it at its center. Drop it in the middle of your finger between all four loops. Then take the strand at the back Pull it forward and make another loop all the way on the left side. Before moving forward, make sure that your strands match mine. So my pattern is the same going from right to left. I have yellow, green, white, and then it repeats yellow, green, white. Also, my strands alternate between which ones are in front of my finger and which ones are in back. So yellow is in the front, then green is in the back, white is in the front, then yellow is in the back, then green is in the front, and finally white is in the back. So make sure that your strands are alternating before going forward. Then take your long piece and bring it under all six of these loops. and pull it through until you get to the middle. Then take your strand on the left and bring it across the top of your finger going over under, over under, over under. and take the strand on the left and bring it across the bottom of your finger going over under, over under, over under.
Now if you take a look at my strands going from right to left, I have on this side, I have a strand, a loop, strand, a loop, and then a loop and a strand. And so that breaks the pattern. So I'm going to take this green strand and bring it between the white and yellow loops. So now I have strand loop, strand loop, strand loop, yellow, green, white, yellow, green, white. If I look at the other side, again it's strand loop, strand loop, strand loop, and white, green, yellow, white, green, yellow. Now slowly pull it off of your finger. And tighten the strands. And now you have officially started. Once you've done the starting stitch, all of your other stitches are exactly like the corkscrew. I'll show you one of them. And just keep repeating that until you're ready to finish. When you are ready to finish your lanyard, do the finishing stitch just like you would for the wall.
Then tighten the strands and cut off the ends, and you are done with the striped corkscrew.